Hey guys, what's going on? It's Conic here, and today we're going to be doing a um, another round of multi-summons or summons on the Bleach Brave Souls platform. Um, I'm only going to be doing this one more time. The, what, what actually, the, the free uh, six-star guaranteed. Um, I have one guaranteed uh, rainbow ticket. I have one guaranteed through the attribute types. We'll do one more multi-summon on the free day, uh, the, the step-up summons. I'm, I'm going to save a lot of my orbs. As you see, I uh, got a lot of orbs for maxing out some of my cards uh, that I got from yesterday's summoning video. Or two days ago, actually, technically. Maybe yesterday? I forgot when I posted it up. Uh, anyway, yeah, yesterday. Um... So I also got the free single summon that I got, and then we're going to go ahead down here and we're going to do two sets of multi-summons on the Brave Souls selection. So let's go ahead and start it off with the attribute. Now, I've been trying to figure out which attribute that I actually want to summon on. Um, I really wasn't sure because I I have essentially uh, the technique or the green um, and the speed, the blue. Those two are my most OP teams that I have. Now, my mind, I have the full hollow Ichigo, I have the new Kugo, and I have Gini Ichimaru. And Gini Ichimaru is a uh, boss killer because he poisons everyone. Easy for him to take everyone out. However, on power, I have the Nuna Noitura, and he has Flurry, which is freaking phenomenal. I didn't realize, um, yet, so I posted up uh, underneath uh, yesterday's video, I pinned a post. I didn't realize that the Noitura that I got was actually the super OP one. I had no freaking clue whatsoever. Um, I thought he, I thought there was only one version of Noitura, and that I got him again. And it turned out he's like some amazing OP unit. I have like the new trifecta, um, or the, the new OP trifecta of cards right now. Because I got this, well, the Ichigo that's on the screen right now. I got him, which is, he is super freaking OP, which I, you know, I knew he was good. I didn't realize how good he was. I watched a whole bunch of YouTube videos about him. So I have him. I have the Dongai Ichigo. I have Full Hollow Ichigo. I have Blue Kenny. I have, I literally have all of the, like, well, not all, of them, but I have majority of the OP units in game at this point. Um, I, I kind of want to be brag about it a little bit. I kind of feel like I want to, you know what I mean? But at the same time, um, I'm, I'm still also trying to figure out what I want. But now I also pulled, um, I have the Hogyoku Aizen, and I have the U Urakura, the, uh, the heart one, the second release form of him. And I have the Lost Agent Toshiro, which is really good for my heart team. So really, um, power, I have some good power units. Um, that says Leporo, uh, he poisons, I have the Christmas version of him, so he's really good with strong attacks and he poisons the enemy, so he's a boss killer. He's really good, and because I, I, that's why I'm going to go with Mind. So let's go ahead and let's do the Mind Summon right now, and let's see what we can get here. I'm, I'm keeping my fingers crossed. I hope I get some like crazy good unit um, that uh, that I, I, I don't currently have. So let's see what we what we got in here. We get we're gonna get a, a choice of five different cards. For the first time, I've experienced ecstasy of being the moment between life and death. Who the heck is that? <gasps> oh, okay. He's probably gonna be my number one choice. Seath. Okay, yeah, I have him. I don't like him. All right, cool. Thank. You for, I kind of. I really hope that all my other cards are really crap. Sort of. This was one big part. I'd be losing out if if you didn't enjoy yourself. Who the hell is that? Okay, cool. I have her too. Um, Uzuru, damn it, um, I, I didn't let it, I should have let it go, I want to read what the hell it has to say. I alone will stand at the top. Aizen, okay, cool. Oh, shoot, alright, so you know what? I'm not upset, I am not upset, because, yeah, um, though, all, what, what is it saying new? That Aizen on the bottom right's not new, he technically is not new at all, I have him already, I'm pretty sure I have him, why would I, well, I mean, it wouldn't say new, but I'm pretty sure I have that lost agent also. Um, anyway, Byakuya, I'm, I'm on the actual, the Brave Souls out of FYI right now. Uh, Byakuya has the highest attack out of everyone on this list right now. And in terms of specials, uh, let's see. No one, no one's on the first page that I've currently pulled right now. At least the ones that, no, I definitely have, oh no, you know what, maybe I don't, I don't have them. Okay, cool, I don't actually. Um, Himaru, Yumichi, Yumichika actually. Um, I wish this would freaking load. The website's kind of down right now. But we're going to pick the Byakuya because he's freaking OP as all hell. Um, yeah, he is super OP. So I'm, I'm, I'm selecting him. I, actually, no, I'm really happy that I did that right now. Oh, I forgot too. Yo, he is at level 200 maxed out. How freaking amazing is that? Level 75. Oh, the only thing that stinks about it is you don't get the 50 for getting into level 100 as a 5 star. But um, I'm cool with that. That's freaking phenomenal. Hell yeah. That is so awesome. I got such a good freaking card with that one. All right, let's go ahead and do my free summon right now. 
Oh man, that actually got me super hyped. So yeah, um, BBS is going crazy right now. Apparently, I also heard it's only, of course, it's going to only be a three star. It's all right, and we level up some other cards. Um, now, apparently, there's going to be a second set of step up summons for the game. So I don't know when that's going to come out, when it's supposed to be released. Um, I don't really plan on going too hard body on this. Before I do that, just in case, because if I pull um, that Grimjow, essentially a Grimjow, the, the Mind Grimjow, is the only one that I want. So let's go ahead and do my guaranteed from the summon. If I get that Mind Grimjow, I'll be super, super pumped. Because he's the only one, like, out of all the cards that I, on, on what's going on so far, I haven't pulled yet. So let's see if I can get super lucky or not. If it will allow me to play a fitting tune. Nope, it's not him. I think it will love Rose. Yeah, I think I already have him. Do I have him? I don't know. I'll find out right now. Yeah, it doesn't matter, but strong attack damage. Okay, cool. Whatever. Um, plus, I think that Byakuya has that special soul trait. Um, where it's what, uh, the, whatever it is, is up to 25% instead of the 20% that it normally is. Unfortunately, again, like I said, F Bleached uh, Brave Souls at FYI is currently down, so I can't get onto the website to, um, actually check it out. But, okay, let's go ahead and do some of uh, these Brave Souls summons. Now, I wait till I have 10 because I have a higher chance of getting a 5-star when I do it. I typically... I I actually think every, watch be the time I'm on camera, but every single time I've done a, a multi-summon on these, yep, this is the first freaking time I've ever gotten a four-star summon. Well, we're going to skip because I don't really need to, you guys don't want to watch it. I know that to watch all the four stars. Um, I didn't really get anything good in here anyway. So let's go ahead and do one more. I've, oh, this is, this is literally history for me. The first time where Brave Soul tickets actually gave me a four-star. Every other time it's been a five-star. So let's go ahead and see. Maybe I can get lucky on this one. And wow, wow, that was a three star. I didn't mean to shout in your ear. I know that kind of got loud right there, but I mean, I guess that's um, good for fodder, you know, so I can get some of those other cards up. Um, I guess that Kugo kind of needs to be raised up a little bit. All right, let me see. Do I, I have some accessory? I usually want to save the accessory ones. I've been trying to do the four or five star on the accessories, um, but I feel like the rates might be better because we're on the uh, two year. So, you know, let's do the three-star or above accessory summon right now. Um, because at least then I know I'm going to get some at least some good accessories in the game. So, let's see here. Come on, give me a, give me a good four-star. One, two. Oh, uh, we got the three. Oh, cool, we got the three. Yes. Oh, we got the four. Oh, oh it's a tension tie. Okay, so don't get me wrong. Now, this is essentially uh, when a special move goes off. Um, that's like the big, the big boss killer move at the end. This increases its power. That's awesome. Don't get me wrong. That's really freaking useful. The problem is I have... I'm pretty sure I have every single four-star Shintai, Shintai that it's available. It's cool, though, because... Oh, look at that. The the, the <laughs> Brave Souls website finally came back up. Um, the, 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 the ten Shintais are, are awesome. Uh, don't get me wrong. But um, I already have them. I mean, it's good to, to get two four-stars together to make a five-star if you need to do something like that. Okay, an incomplete Hogyoku for our wrong cars. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a lot of our own cars. <laughs> um, okay. Not bad. Give me, um, a, uh, I guess. Oh, that's horrible. None of them are new. None of them are new. That's such garbage. All right, well, let's go. Okay, I have 210 out of 220. Yeah, I'm not going to do another one of those. I've been, I'm kind of tempted, guys, to actually do some item summons. So that way I could try to get myself some gold cat, uh, chappies and what else is on here. Um, oh, this is the new, uh, center of the Bolton special increase experience. Yeah, that's fine. That's, I don't want that. Um, yeah, I'm not doing those four or five star accessory tickets until I get like a, a whole bunch of them. I want to get 10 of them, then I'll do some of them. But, um, yeah, you know what? Let's, uh, I was taking a look and seeing what else I got. Yeah, those are all garbage. Um, okay, guys, you know what? Let's just do one more step up summon. Um, I have 3,100 orbs. I'm going to be saving the rest of them for the second set of step up summons. Now, again, uh, as you guys know, I am not uh, I'm not a big uh, Bleach player, or at least a YouTuber for it. I do play the game, but my primary is Dokkan Battle. But I will come back with the step up summons when they get renewed. I just want to see if I can get that uh, get one more shot at that. Um, Grimjow, just because I heard he's super freaking good, and I could definitely use another mind character. My mind is the team that's really lacking the most, and who knows, maybe I'll get um, another card that I don't have. Let's go ahead and take a look really quick. What is this? So these... Oh, no, that's not it. Uh, 
Okay, so these are all the ones I have, So, or the, that are available. Now, uh, I pulled every single one of these in the last video, except for uh, Yukio. Um, uh, shoot, this guy. The, um, it's the one that starts with a T, Taitsukum, something like that. Um, yeah, anyway. So there's about three cards on here that I, could, that I could actually potentially pull that I don't have. But you know what? They, we also get some bonuses. It's definitely worth it. So let's go ahead and do it. I think it's like a, a, five, a six, five or six percent pull rate or something like that, or it's doubled, whatever it normally is. So let's see if we get something good here. Okay, cool. We got a, a five star. So I mean, I read, I'm not ready, not upset with this. That's just sick. Go home, you stupid pervert. You know what? That Ruruka is really good. Now I'm going to keep her for her soul trait. I'm not going to feed her in. I'm going to keep her for the soul trait because I'm pretty sure she's the one with the soul trait that is uh, higher than a normal soul trait. So that makes her super freaking good. Yeah, okay. Get out of here, Jackie. All right. Yumi Chika. Shao Long. Reminds me of Jackie Chan Adventures. Zhao Long Wong. Dao Long Wong. Pimpachi. Yeah, the power of Kimpachi is the only one I don't have now. Um, yeah, hers is strong attack damage. I think plus 25% when she gets a, do a Doken Awakening. Hey, listen to me, Doken Awaken. When she gets a six-star Awakening. So let's go ahead and save that. Um, I'm going to have to get her, both of her versions now, uh, uh, going to say Z Awakened, uh, get them uh, awakened to six stars. That way I can benefit from the strong attack. But hey guys, that's it. Um, that's all I'm doing until the second round of Step Up Summons come around. Let me know what you guys got down in the comments below if you decide to do this. Um, or if you decided to, uh, you know, just play Dokkan and do some summonings or play whatever, let me know what's going on. But, um, again... Let me know if you guys will play this down in the comments below. I know a lot of you said in the last video that you don't. Um, if you know, It's not a bad game. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun because it's hack and slash and you actually control the characters. Um, K-Lab, the, the people who create the game, push the game to the limits in terms of what mobile devices can handle. Um, actually to a point where sometimes it gets annoying because your phone can't handle it and you know sometimes it will lag and glitch and you'll die. But uh, if you're not using special attacks, you're guaranteed to have a good time. But again, thank you guys. Subscribe if you're new here, and I'll catch you in the next video.